Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Jam coming with to you, bleh, coming at you with another fab wig review. This is one of my super beauty store finds. Let me just show you. That's right, as is $5.99. Now, this was a wig that I purchased on display. They call it the display sale at the beauty supply store that I love going to. It's become one of my favorites because I am keep coming across tags like this. And let, let you know this wig is this wig. It's the Houston wig. Now, I came across this wig before in another beauty supply store and this wig was like $29.99 um, regular price. Now, I purchased this as is. Reason being because it was the last one. And it wasn't 1B. Now, with me, I don't like dark hair. So, I'm um, go experiment, y'all. I've seen somebody do it before, but it didn't really look cute on their wig, per se. But I bought some uh, hairspray. And what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to actually, I'm going to cut, I'm, I'm going to spray the wig, you know, this color here. I'm going to try to give it a little bit of highlights here. Because the wig is a 1B, and when I tried this wig on, I instantly fell in love with the wig. This is definitely a love find. I mean, it was definitely a love find. I mean, this wig, it was their last unit, but it's practically brand new. A brand new unit. But it's just the color I'm not a fan of. Definitely not a fan of the wig, so... um. I'm going to do this in front of y'all because I'm not sure how this going to look, but let me see here. Okay, well, that's, the tint helps. Let me see here. Oh, I like this, y'all. Yeah, this wig is starting to look a little better with some color. Let me see what I can do with this bang, because this bang is... Oh, it's bus. It's 1B. Okay. All right, so I gave the wig a little bit of highlights, y'all, because that was the only way I was going to be able to wear this wig here. So let me... Uh-oh, I'm out of focus. I'm out of focus! There I go. Okay. So we're going to cut this tag off, this wig, and I'm going to try it off try it on. I'm not re-recording. I'm going to try it on for you guys. Freshly uh, highlighted. As soon as I can get this tag off. And I realize I kept my wig on. And you know I'm kind of good ghetto. I'm just going to pull it off right in front of y'all and try on this one. But, you know, you can't beat your beauty store finds. In this particular store I go to, they have display sales, which is basically they're trying to get rid of some of their stock and um, their wigs have been sitting on a shelf for a long time. They have different prices starting at $5.99 and then it goes up and up and up. And, you know, in most, in most cases, you know, this practically was a brand new wig. It was just the last one. And when I came across it, they had pretty much just put the wig out there on a display. I literally walked in the store five minutes after the young lady put the wig on display. So, you know, luck of being a wigger. But um, 
I like the copper highlights. Um, it was between this and red, and I have a lot of wigs with red and burgundy. So I say I'll try something different. So I'm going to take my unit off here. My arms big. Woo! All righty. This has become my favorite go-to wig here. I have so many favorites. Don't be in a wiggle. You realize you have a lot of favorite wigs. I know it ain't just me. Okay. okay. All right. Ladies, gent, divas, divos. Here come my love find. Let me adjust these tabs in the back. I'm just messing up all my wordings. I know I said tabs. Y'all know what I meant to say. So just these bands here. And she's a basic wig, no combs. Um, this is a Janet Collection wig. Uh, this is the Houston wig. It was a color 1B. As you see, I just sprayed it with some highlights because I just can't do 1B. At least not anymore. So here we go. Just these rig tabs. Alrighty. Okay. Alrighty. Let me see here. All right, love this wig. I mean, this was a great find. I love the little bit of highlights I did to it. I didn't overdo it with the spray. I made sure I kept my distance because I didn't want it to look too, too heavy, but I just couldn't have it all the way 1B. I just had to spray some highlights on it. I probably can add a little more highlights, uh, probably right here, maybe. I don't know. Y'all tell me what y'all think. But this is the Houston wig by Janet Collection. I found this unit for $5.99. This was the last unit for this particular wig at the store that I purchased my wigs from, one of the stores I go to. The size, you know, I got a thing with my size, y'all. Wait a minute. Look at the little hairs. A wig with baby hairs. Okay, let's see here. Okay. So this is the wig here. I love this wig. I love the fact, well, this side here, the flatness. I just love wigs that have that 27 piece look. Love, 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 love wigs like that. Um, especially when they're very stylish. This is um, a different look. This is this is actually a nice wig. I would definitely say this is a love find. This is a love find, but I have another love find that's coming up that I just, because not every wig I get is a love find. I just buy because it's a cute wig. It's a nice looking wig, but some wigs like this here would definitely get some wear. Um, I'm not sure if it takes any heat. Um, I don't think it does because it's a, a wig, regular wig, and it does not. This is a kind of cologne hair and the Houston wig. It doesn't get no better than this. When you're a wigger like me and you come across fast like this, this is just like... The music start playing in the background, and it, you, the stars and the butterflies. I'm like, oh, five ninety But um, it's really quick and simple review. So let me give you guys a front view of the wig. Those with my little bit of 
highlights I sprayed myself there. So on the side. I don't feel like I got the wig on tight. I probably should have put it a little tight, but from the back. And from the side here. Okay. So this was a really cute find. Uh, this will be part of my short series find, I like to call them, when I find a really nice short wig. This definitely is a go-to wig when you don't want a whole lot on your shoulder or on your neck. Um, that's what I really love about my, my short units like this, where you can just grab something. You want something cute and short, you ain't got no hair on your, your face that much, nothing on your neck or your back. You know, you wear that, I say that normally when I like to go out to clubs, but, you know, sometimes I wear these little numbers, too. Wait a minute, I see a little cool. Wait a minute. Um, I love the little hairs right here for the front of the wig. Uh, I, you know, I almost look, you know, like lace fronts have baby hairs. It's like a wig with baby hair, <laughs> in a way. Um, on the, on the, the picture here, they have... Seem like the top like more spaced out, but but I think I'm wearing it okay as far as the bang on the side and stuff. This is a really nice wig, and um, you know, for this price, I was not gonna leave it behind. That's for sure. Um, I might add a little bit more highlights to it, not too much, cause I don't wanna, you know, overpower it, cause this is regular, um, you know, temporary spray, um, in color copper number 80 copper and um that's pretty much it for this wig it's nothing to it when it's a short wig you just pretty much you're taking it out the pack and put it on your head it ain't too much you got to do after that just wear it i got on some short earrings because that's what i had on today but you know i probably wear this out with some more bolder earrings you know till next time you know me like, review, comment, likes make me happy. Um, take the time to like my add away block um, and like my Facebook fan page. I also have a Twitter. My Twitter, I mainly promote, again, my add away. I get on Twitter sometimes, but if you want to follow me on Twitter, you can. My name is Big Sexy Jam on Twitter. And I'm on Instagram also, Big Sexy Jam on Instagram if you want. Um, again, till next time. Stay tuned. Next review is soon.